What determines which problems you blame others for versus problems you blame yourself for? Mm -hmm. So you would blame others for situations where you were misled and you blame yourself for something which you did on your own with no influence whatsoever. Why is it when women are called out on their bad behavior, they often blame society or how they were raised, but when men are called out, they're more likely to be held accountable? Because it's an easy out for women to do that, um, to blame others, but at the end of the day, it's your own decisions. Because of the whole like Me Too movement, it's so easy for women to fall back on that as an excuse. It's not necessarily that they shouldn't be held accountable for their own actions. It's more so that the media has made it really easy for them to use it as a scapegoat. So if you guys don't know, one of my viral videos long time ago when I first started this shit was accountability. Um, and I just have to say something. I will not be around any man or any woman who will never hold themselves accountable. If you're the type of person to literally blame me for the things you put yourself in or blame others or you have a victim mindset, I will steer far from you. Yes, I understand things happen. Things are inevitable. I get that. But when you're constantly blaming things, you put yourself in these situations or like some women, I've seen videos before where the man will catch them cheating and they're screaming, crying, and then they start, well, you this and you that. No, take the heat. You slurped 20 peepees, you cheated, it's your fault. Let that fire burn your fucking body up. Don't try to bring that shit over here because you can't handle what you did. This is the thing that I don't understand about a lot of women. Y'all will sit there all the time, and I've seen it so many times, countless times, be wrong as hell, you cheated, Pull the crocodile tears instead of just saying sorry, instead of just saying I'm wrong. Do you not understand psychologically how sick that is to try to reverse psychology someone into thinking that it's their fault? And then most of the time men do blame themselves for a lot of things. Do you not understand when we're sad or we go through certain things, especially in a relationship, our man takes on that burden, whether you want to believe this or not. So now he has to take on the burden of you lying or you cheating or you whatever. That's not right. I feel like a lot of women in this society don't know how to apologize and don't know how to take accountability. And the reason why I say that, and a lot of you are going to be like, oh, no, that's not true. Then why does every woman get mad at my page and say that I'm critic not even criticizing you. I'm hating on you. I'm bashing you. But I am a woman. I'm giving men the scoop on how to maneuver with women and be careful for women like the ones I'm always talking about. So when you really think about it, I'm not understanding if I was really out here bashing y'all, I'm just giving you fucking criticism and you don't like it. If somebody gave me criticism and I was doing wrong, by all means, correct me. If you know something I don't know, correct me. But like I said, y'all, when it comes to certain people and it's not just women, I've just noticed a lot of women do it. If I see you and you cannot take accountability and you blame everybody besides yourself, stay the fuck away from me.